Hello everybody and welcome back to Minecraft Dungeons. My name is Tolkien Force and today we are going to be taking on Cacti Canyon. Last time we did the Redstone Mines and before that we did the Creeper Woods. But Cacti Canyon is what we're going to be going for now. So we're going to start the mission on a maybe difficulty. I have a, my power is 6 so maybe 16? No, I'll, I'll still rock 10. It was a little difficult. I almost lost the Redstone Mines. So we're just going to deal with it as is. So let's get to it. The Arch Illager seeks to summon armies of the undead using a power that rests deep within an ancient and forgotten desert temple. Finding the temple, however, is an adventure in its own right, for the entrance lies hidden somewhere in this canyon, a sprawling maze of malevolent mobs and lost secrets. How many uh, secrets? One secret, two chests. That's really not that many. So sometimes you can get like 10 secrets and 25 chests. <laughs> so to see uh, to see the one and two, it's really not that good. But uh, yeah, let's get to it. I think, ooh, little baby zombie. Those guys suck. I think this level has geomancers in it, which uh, bring up bring up like stone columns and stuff like that. So that's not too lucky. <laughs> uh, but I do have a different chance of loot here um, besides a sword, so that'll be good. Let's kill some of these guys. Look, I'm, all, I'm already almost dead. <laughs> that's that's embarrassing. Oh my gosh, stop hitting me! <laughs> stop it! Oh my gosh, I'm gonna die because I just can't freaking kill these archers. I'm like three seconds into the level. <laughs> and I can't, like, I can't kill them. Oh my gosh, okay. Jeez Louise. Alright, at least I've got the infinity bow that we were able to acquire in the last episode. But like, holy cow. Also, if you see the uh, the souls that I gather, they kind of like zoom to me. They're like blue. You can see them. They, got look, they look like little faces. They go underneath where my artifacts are and I have like that little bar there. And when it's full, I can use more. But if it's not full... But that... <laughs> that's my beacon. Um, I almost died. <laughs> Why do I suck? All right. Hey, another crossbow. I'm going to have to use a potion. Holy cow, I suck. All right, let's continue. There's a thousand million people here. Thank heavens for the level up. Holy cow. Go away, creepers. Why are these guys so strong? Anything good? Oh my gosh, I need to use a potion. Go away. There's so many of them. I'm like getting surrounded. How many arrows do I got left? I, get, I still got 90, so I'm not doing terrible. It's because I got that infinity. If I didn't have infinity, these arrows would be gone. <laughs> okay, let's see the armor. Level 10. I'm taking it. I don't care what it is. Let's get rid of that. What is the bonus on this blinking armor? Weapon damage boost and gives me a pet bat. Whoop de doo. Oh my gosh, back away. I'm gonna die. I need I need the apple. I need a little bit of regen. Stop hitting me. Where am I going? I gotta go up. Drink that potion. Alright. Oh my gosh, and I just drank the potion and there's bread right here. Bread gives me regen for 30 seconds brings me up to 100%. So, yeah, there's that. Ooh, some TNT. How did they hit me? Or what did they hit me with? Not how did they hit me. Uh, I guess how did they hit me. Yeah. All right, we're taking these guys on. Go away. Okay. They gave me some better armor. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of the beacon, but early on, it's not the worst thing in the world. Because you can kind of you can kind of hit a lot of people all at the same time. Go away. All right. Power of the beacons. One out of five. Let's do it. Alright, 
Beacon number four. There it is. Kill that guy. Beacon number five, and we should be good to go. Let's see if this guy drops any pork. Nope. I always like it when the sheep drop pork. I am curious. If you guys have seen any gameplays on a, on this game, I'd like to know what your favorite uh, area is. Um, I really like pumpkin pastures, which we'll get to in a later time. But, yeah, pumpkin pastures is probably... Oh, the skeleton horseman. I don't think I'm prepared for you guys. Oof. I do like the rock music, though, I must say. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to die. Get him. Get him. Get him. Oh, my gosh. Stop hitting me. Stop hitting me. Stop hitting me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. They're so close to death. Can you kill death? I missed. Stop run... Stop running away! Okay. Is that all of them? No, there's one more. Woof! Come on. Oh my gosh, the cactuses are in the way. I can't hit you if the cactuses are in the way! Woof! Alright. Don't, don't, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Alright. I need better freaking swords. <laughs> I might have some smite on my weapon, but man, is it not good enough against these freaking vindicators and creepers and crap. Ugh, okay. Whew, are you guys sweating as much as I'm sweating? Because holy cow, don't, 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 don't even think about it. Alright, what do we got going on over here? Oh, a piggy! Piggy! Piggy, 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 piggy. Come back, come back. You're gonna you're gonna give me what I need. There we go. What did you give me? A freaking wind horn and a bow. Ugh. Alright, let's check it out. Come on. Alright. Can I check it out yet? Alright. Level 7. It's, I, I, it might be better than the rapid fire crossbow because it does more than 6 damage. But it's not fast like this. But I'll probably equip it anyway, get rid of it. And I'll equip the wind horn on nothing, because I don't want to use it. Yeah. What kind of enchantments can we put on my spelunking armor? Swift footed? Ooh, that's pretty good. Ah, uh, rolling. And then burns people. Let's burn people. And let's get this a uh, bonus shot or power. Let's do power. Alright. Oh, wait, what's this? A level 12? When did I get this? All right, well, we're going to get rid of that. And we are going to give it infinity. <laughs> All right. Let's take on this guy right here. Cuz if I don't take that guy, let's see, let's see the damage. Yeah, that's better than the uh That is better than my uh my rapid crossbow. It might not be faster, but man does it do a lot more damage. And it only does 61. <laughs> that's not that good. Alright, but I've got the infinity on it. Not that it matters, because I got 49 arrows. I was actually saying. I, I was looking at it, I thought I had 711 arrows. So it actually does matter, because I've only got 47. Alright, what do we got here? We got a blue door. Which means we've got to find a blue key. I don't remember where the rune is here. Which is a little unfortunate. So, bear with me while I, uh, suffer. <laughs> Alright, so there's the yellow key. This is the yellow door. I need to get the blue key. Um, I think the blue key is over this way. If I can remember correctly. Yes. But before I get too close, I'm going to want to kill some of those guys. Ah, uh, the rune didn't appear. I wonder if the rune can't appear unless I'm, uh... Unless I'm a higher level. That would be something good to know. I'm gonna die. Alright, kill them. Is that everybody? That is everybody. Yeah, so the rune is supposed to appear right behind these palm trees. And there's a little button. And then it would be behind this little door. But if you notice on the map... No, it still kind of says that it exists. Well, not really. Alright, well, whatever. No! Key, come back! Stop running away! Okay. I think we're good. Whew! All 
Alright, come on. So I might not have my legendary glaive and my legendary, uh... I'm gonna heal right now. My legendary axes and things like that, where I can get, like, double, triple prospect. And all sorts of, like, radiance and other crap. But, you know what? Starting afresh is always good, too. Let's get this key. Oof, I'm getting lightheaded. Alright, we're good. Oof, we're good. Don't not kill me. Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. I'm not ready to die. Does this, does this level have a boss like it did at the end of the other one with the uh, redstone golem? I don't remember. The more guys I can kill from afar, the better. And the more TNT I can acquire, also the better. And I... Just, uh, I forget you throw the TNT. When you want to shoot an arrow. All right, where are we going? All right, nowhere else. We're going this way. Did we get all the chests? One out of two. I didn't open a chest. That's fine. Go away. All right, so it might not be a boss at the end, but it's definitely a horde of googlies. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> all right. I had to use a heal. No! No! The creepers! Ah, oh, that's too many. That's too many people. That's too many people. That's too many people. Get back away, back away, back away, back away. Holy cow. Go away, go away, go away. I, don't, I cannot, I cannot handle this right now. Whew. Level up. Thank heavens for the level up. Oh, they're still spawning. Ah, oh, give me the pork, give me the pork. Run away, run away. I don't like it. Give me the bread, give me the apple. Holy cow. I think there's a secret over this way. Is it a chest? No. Why would it give me a secret chest? What about up here? Any secrets up here? No. Why would there be secrets up there? I found the desert temple. Yes! Ah, you found the ancient desert temple. Who knows what truths and treasures await you inside? All right, well, I dealed 17,000 damage. I'd say that's pretty good. Not compared to the 5, 6 million I can do in my other game, but that's fine. Ooh, a level 16 Corrupted Beacon. Yeah, that's a lot better than my level 7 that I'm rocking. We're just going to get rid of that. Yeah, the Windhorn uh, pushes enemies away from you and slows them briefly. So, I mean, it's nice, but I kind of got this Firework Arrow, so... It also does damage. Look at my little guy. Look at his little face. Arr, hello. How are you guys doing? <laughs> Alright. Well, I got uh, myself a nice little spelunker armor. I got myself a heavy crossbow with some infinity on it. And I still have a level 7 spining sword. Not the worst. Really not that good. I think I'm going to grab something from the blacksmith just because... No. Give me something good. I don't want to waste my emeralds. Uh, This has prospector on it. What does this have? Smiting? Smiting 2? Goodbye. Smiting sword. And I'm going to give it weakening. I want Prospector because it gives me more emeralds. Oh, sharpness could be good. Weakening attack damage to the nearby enemies. Yeah, I kind of want weakening. Sharpness might be good, but weakening is going to be better. So here, let's test it out on the little dummy over here. Yeah, see, it's faster. He's like dealing 10, 10, 10, 10. Was that better than my sword? Maybe not. Uh, I could use the level 15 hammer. 52... Does it have anything else special? Great splash. All right. Goodbye, sickles. I like the sickles. Goodbye, whatever this crossbow is, because that's garbage. And thundering fire aspect or echo. Some of your attacks can be followed up by another attack in rapid succession. Might be good. Or I could summon lightning and I could have Mjolnir. That could be pretty fun. I say echo. Mainly because it's got a pretty slow attack and if I were to have another rapid uh, there we go see another rapid in succession it'll be fine but I think I'm gonna leave this episode of Minecraft Dungeons here if you liked it awesome if you didn't oh well and that's pretty much all I've got for you for right now and I'll see y'all in the next episode have a good one <laughs>